Switzerland is a small-scale country with a lot of things to see and do. From breathtaking mountain peaks to gorgeous blue lakes and a countryside rich in historical antiquities, Switzerland has something for everyone. Certainly, there is so much to see and do inside the borders of Switzerland that expats and visitors alike may find it difficult to decide where to go next. But don't be concerned. With our top 10 places to visit in Switzerland guide, you'll be able to soak up the breathtaking beauty of this unforgettable alpine gem in no time. Here's the 10 most beautiful cities in Switzerland you have to visit. Number 10. St. Moritz. Known as the home of alpine winter tourism, greets visitors with world-class skiing, elegant hotels, and top-notch restaurants. St. Moritz offers great cross-country skiing, sledding, and winter walks in addition to its well-acclaimed downhill skiing tracks, which have hosted the Olympics twice. During the summer, the area welcomes outdoor enthusiasts to golf, ride, walk, or participate in water sports and swim in the nearby lakes. Number 9. Zermatt is the place to go if you want to ski or snowboard in the Swiss Alps. The Matterhorn, a peak so iconic that it inspired a Disneyland attraction, and Switzerland's highest ski resort are both located in this little town in the Alps. Skiers and snowboarders of all levels can spend most of their vacation on the slopes, which provide breathtaking mountain vistas. Visitors can ride the Gornergrat train after shredding powder, buy a block of handcrafted chocolate from a local shop, or eat cheese fondue at a classic Swiss restaurant. Number 8. Interlaken is a beautiful vacation destination because of its unusual location between two lakes, Lake Brienz and Lake Thun. You can spend hours here exploring numerous routes, kayaking around the lakes, or looking out the harder calm observation platform at the surrounding mountains, accessible via a funicular. Take a ride on the Skynage Platt Railway or sign up for a paragliding or skydiving tour to explore more of the region's breathtaking beauty. Number 7. Everything you've probably heard about the Swiss Alps is true, it's a breathtakingly beautiful place that everybody should visit at least once in their lives. This alpine area of Switzerland offers one-of-a-kind beauty for making lifelong memories, from craggy, sky-high peaks to verdant valleys that seem to stretch on forever to charming medieval mountain towns that overlook lovely lakes and rivers. Spend some time hiking or skiing the mountain routes when you're not admiring your surroundings. Number 6. It doesn't get much more impressive than a country full of picture-perfect lakeside cities. The tiny medieval town is nestled between three massive mountains on the borders of Lake Lucerne. You may explore historic cathedrals, bustling squares, and a wealth of boutiques while appreciating the city's architectural marvels. The highlight is the Chapel Bridge, a covered wooden bridge that has united the core of Lucerne since 1333. Number 5. A trip to Lugano, Switzerland's southernmost city, will allow you to observe the country in a whole new light. The city is known as Switzerland's Monte Carlo and is located on the beautiful Lake Lugano's beaches and blends Swiss and Italian traditions into a fantastic weekend getaway. Because of the number of museums and the gentle Mediterranean winds, you could think you're in nearby Italy when you arrive. The lovely hillsides that rise from the lake, just outside the city, are studded with impressive mansions. Number 4. Bern is not just the metropolis of Switzerland but at the same time, one of the most lovely tourist attractions in the country. When you walk through the narrow cobblestone alleyways of the old town, it's easy to see why it's a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Bern's historic center is home to an abundance of shops, taverns, and bears. Bear Park, which lies immediately across the river from the old town, is home to a family of bears, the city's symbol. If that weren't enough, the city is home to a slew of lively markets, including some spectacular Christmas markets over the holidays. Number 3. Visitors may not be as familiar with Montreux as they are with its Lake Geneva neighbors, which is part of what makes the Swiss town so special. It is a picturesque ancient town with a seaside promenade adorned with flowers and trees, a medieval castle, and a memorial commemorating Freddie Mercury, Queen recorded multiple albums here from 1979 to 1996. Montreux is also surrounded by vineyards, and every summer, it holds a major jazz festival. Number 2. Geneva Located in a valley on Switzerland's western border, provides a tranquil setting for a relaxing holiday. 
Its cobblestone walkways are lined with outdoor cafes and small businesses, while the city's more cosmopolitan areas are teeming with designer labels and fine dining establishments. Inside the Victoria Hall, fans are cradled by plush chairs as world-class orchestras perform. Even fine dining is regarded as an art form here. Despite its elegance, Geneva can make you sweat. Popular sports include sailing on the lake, strolling or jogging in the parks, and skiing down the adjacent slopes of Mont Blanc. Number 1. Switzerland's largest city, Zurich, is also the country's social and cultural center. Despite its world-famous financial services, Zurich boasts a surprisingly active social scene. There's a lot going on, from the popular Pride March to Europe's largest street rave. And, if that wasn't enough, the city is aesthetically pleasing, from the beautiful streets of the old town to the breathtaking views of Lake Zurich. For more articles visit expatrace.com.